everybody i've got a asa challenge lock from johan from sweden his youtube name is asfodus as you can see it's locked up uh, he sent me this it's a really evil lock i must say um, sometimes it picks open like a bit quicker than other times and then sometimes it just doesn't like picking open quick i don't know what is injected in here but it's something evil And pin 1 is really hard to get underneath. There I've got a fault set. As you can see. Come on. Come on. See what I mean? I've lost the fault set. The problem is once you lose that fault set, you, I sort of lose the tension control as well. So I'm resetting it again. There, I've got it again. No. Yeah, I've got a big fault set now. So hopefully pin one if it clears. I lost the fault set again. Got it again. If you can hear them evil clicks. There I've got a big fault set now. Come on. I know from here now I've got one pin left. I'm holding my pick a bit funny but... The only way I can get underneath these pins is like holding the pick this way. Come on, where are you now? Sometimes you could have the lock pick, but you got to turn it hard. Oh, 
come on. Oh, my knee is challenged off in this. If you watched Asphodus video, he has the same problem when he's picking one of these locks. He couldn't seem to point out that one pin like I'm doing now. Yeah, I think it's pin one. I think a deeper hook should do it. And a deeper hook. Try this one. The good old software ten B. Yes, got it. Thank God I got that. It was pin five or six, I think. Here it is. Now let's do the gutting now. I've got everything prepared today. So let's get the pinning tray here. Let's get the bloody C-clip off. I ain't got a key for this lock. So this is the uh thingy he sent me i think he used it something like this <sighs> yeah next life so easy Pins gone flying somewhere. Hopefully, 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 I think it's this follower. So here you are, guys. I'm gonna this. Where's my tweezers? First time I've got everything. I hope it comes out. Bloody hell, it's not pushing through. What's up in here? All right, right, I got it, I got it. Oh, fucking hell, look at that nasty spring. That's sick. Sick. I ain't seen pins like that. So, so. Okay. Right. It's because the springs are so big, I think. Come on. Bloody hell, come on. Oh shit. I've already lost two pins. No, stay like this, stay like this. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's pin five, I think. This is one of the pins. Right, that's fucking hell, I ain't seen pins like this. 
Right, I think I got it now, guys. Whoa, bloody hell, look at these pins, yo. It's just flying out. Talk about serrated guys. Yes, guys. Yeah, guys. Got it done now. It's a seven one. Yes, it's a full seven pin lock. Bloody hell! Come on, that's number two. These are some evil pins. Even I can't make them this good. Guys, there you go. That's the seven pin as a lock. Yep. I'll show you the pins. I'll just put them the right way around. Guys, look at these pins, man. I hope you... Oh, fuck's sake. Right, the, the key pins are all regular. But look at these. I hope you got... It. I'll just have to show you all one by one. It's not working in this. I hate cutting bloody locks. But guys, what can you do? Yeah, you are, guys, man. Jesus. This is pin one. That's the driver pin, pin one. It's like sort of a serrated, it's serrated definitely. Pin two is the same as this, now pin three. Check this out guys. It's like a, one of them homemade spools. This is the other end of it. I'm trying to get it from the end without it flying. There you go, guys. Basically, it looks like this. Right. So, we've got one of them. Then it's a serrated one again. Lovely looking serrated pins, I must say. That's a serrated. Then this is a. Uh, there's another serrated, but it's got like <clears throat> spool at the end of it. Then you got check this one out, guys. This is a lovely looking pin. Check this out, guys. It's like in between a trampoline and a and a tea pin. Then you got the same one in chamber seven, but it's smaller, as you can see. Sorry guys, it took so long and I've made a mess. Thank you very much for watching.